YouTube fam, it's your girl Gladys. Welcome back to the channel. I miss y'all. How have y'all been? Drop a comment and let me know how this year is going for you. Thank y'all for being so patient in my absence. I definitely will explain all of that at another time. I am bringing back a series that I used to have on this channel called Small Talk Saturdays, where we'll be getting a little bit more personal and it'll be on Saturdays, so look out for that. But for right now, we're gonna focus on these wigs. I know it's been a minute. Y'all see I have braids in my hair. I've had these in for like a month and a half. But I started a series on my Instagram and TikTok, same name as at your hair, where I talked about the 23 wigs that I'm bringing into 2023. It gained traction on both platforms. So I was like, you know what? I need to bring this to YouTube. I'm finally getting this video out. Make sure you drop a comment if this video is very helpful to you. If you end up adding anything to the car, let me know. Or if you've tried them yourself already, share with us in the comments. Today is $20 Tuesday, and $20 Tuesday is a special time on my channel where I showcase super cute wigs for the lovely $20 price range and below. Oh, I miss saying that. <laughs> Can you believe this is episode 90? Like, when did that happen? I'm so proud of us. I'm really excited for episode 100. Can you guys leave me comments? Let me know what we should do for the 100th episode of $20 Tuesday. Let me know. I'm also trying to figure out what the frequency is going to be because I know I did $20 Tuesday every week. But since I have not been as consistent on YouTube lately, I don't know if I can keep that up at this current moment. But I will keep y'all posted. So this first wig right here on the list. Woo! Ooh, every time I talk about this wig on Instagram, y'all sell it out somewhere. This is Nisha H301, and she is bomb.com. I really need to repurchase this wig and show you exactly how I styled it. It was nothing crazy, but a lot of people asked me to do a tutorial, and I realized I never actually show how I do it. It is a half wig, so it's very beginner friendly. I just flipped it over and that's how the curls ended up falling on me. I didn't do anything else to that wig. I absolutely love the texture and if you know me, you know I'm a textured girl. I love hair that mimics my natural hair, whether it be kinky curly, kinky coily, blown out straight. So this is what H301 is giving and of course it's by Outre and they do textures, especially in colors, very well. 10 out of 10 Nisha H301. Definitely consider copying it, especially if you like voluminous hair now wig number two <laughs> i actually did not try this wig until 2023 because that's when it came out and honey let me tell you i it's gonna be in my arsenal for the rest of the year look at this look at this wig This is Miss Brinley. I have this wig in five colors. I haven't shown you all the colors yet, but I have the copper. I have the um, the brown color. I'll make sure the colors are in the description box. I have it in the regular two color, of course. She just gives in every color and every lighting setting. I, I absolutely adore her. Now, one of my videos from last month, you may have seen me review this wig and do a tutorial where I show you how to make it look natural. And the main trick is really just plucking those hairs out the part. Out of that crown area, that's what you have to do in order for it to lay flat. That's the issue I have with synthetic bang wigs is that most of them do not come with a lace closure. So you're just left with a lot of hair that's gathering at the crown and that's not cool because it looks too wiggy for me. So that's why I have to pluck out the hairs and voila that's how i was able to achieve the look you see here you can find this wig anywhere from like 18 dollars to 30 dollars it depends on where you shop y'all know me i am an amazon affiliate so i do recommend a lot of wigs that you can find on amazon i do link everything in my description box and of course if you shop through my links you are directly supporting your girl so consider shopping through amazon but of course you can find these wigs anywhere if you just search the name on google too this is another wig that just doesn't let up Petal to the metal every time I wear this wig. Every time I show this wig, it sells out. Out. The last time I talked about it, it sold out and I just noticed it restocked on Amazon again. Nakai is that girl. I definitely rated it as one of my top synthetic half wigs of all time. I have a video on that and I'll make sure I'll link it so you can check that out. The reason why I love Nakai so much is because the texture mimics my natural hair extremely well and i like that it's a short curled bob style it looks extremely natural if i wear that wig with leave out you're there's no way you think that's not my hair you it's mine 
<laughs> I love that. I love when I can find a wig that can fool the girls a little bit. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of you have tried Nakaya as well and have raved about her in my DMs, in the comment section. So I just had to put her out there again, okay? I definitely saw her online at one point for as low as $15. Right now she's on Amazon for I believe $27. So you take your pick. She is probably gonna sell it again. <laughs> Especially if this video gains traction. <laughs> but y'all know I like to keep y'all up to date in my YouTube community tab. So when certain wigs that I know are really popular on my channel come back in stock, I will post about them on the community tab so that y'all have first dibs. So make sure you check that out. And also I like to post things in my Instagram stories, updating everyone. So make sure you follow me on Instagram. Is that your hair? By the way, we just reached a major milestone on Instagram. We reached 30,000 subscribers. So excited about that. I did an entire photo shoot. You know, I just got my whole life. I got some balloons and one of my homegirls helped me out and we blew them up. It was just so beautiful. I loved it. And especially considering, you know, how this year has started and has been going, I really needed that ray of sunshine in my life. So thank you all so much who follow me on Instagram. Thank you for contributing to 30K. It really means a lot to me. Wig number four is a true throw on and go, y'all. Another Outre wig. This is from the Converti Cap series, Miss Hawaiian Hottie. And look how easy, breezy, and simple she is. Straight, 16 inch half wig. Again, this is another textured wig. And I think all the wigs on this list, almost all of them, have this nice texture that mimics type four hair. So if you like that, you're gonna love this entire video. But Hawaiian Hottie. I really like her because this was after the Converti Cap series got a revamp. So these wigs actually lay a little bit flatter on your head when you apply them versus the half wigs from yesteryear. So I'm really, really happy about that. And she's just a great style. You can wear it with the headband as you see I did, but wearing her with my natural hair out, maybe in a ponytail, would look super natural as well. So this next wig definitely held me down for a good portion of 2022. This is by Outre, of course, and this is their Dominican blowout wig in the 22 inches. This is my first time trying a synthetic U-part wig that was also a human hair blend. It's a beautiful unit, absolutely gorgeous unit i'm trying to remember if this wig came with clips or combs i know a lot of people stay away from the combs because over time they can take out your hair to each his own if you plan on wearing this every day you may not want to use the combs you might want to use bobby pins instead it's up to you overall i really really love <laughs> this U part wig and this came out back when V parts and U parts were trending too so a lot of people were excited about this drop and they have other styles for this line as well they have a spiral curl one that I actually have in the closet I just never took it out the pack and I bought an entire curling iron just for that wig <laughs> What is going on, Gladys? You need to get together. So they have different styles. I believe four different ones. Check it out. The quality is there, especially for the price. Like, what? I know right now it's $28 on Amazon. So go ahead and go in that description box and tap that link. Look, let me tell you something about me. If you're new here, whenever I recommend something, I'm not going to steer you wrong. Y'all can serve as my testimony in the comments. Let people know you're going to receive your wig and feel like the baddest bitch alive. <laughs> So trust me on this, if you want something that is super natural and seamless with your hair, that will blend with your hair, get this wig. I initially got the natural black color because at the time it was the only color available, but I would definitely go back and purchase the natural brown just to see how that blends with my number two hair. Okay, for this next wig, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just gonna roll the clip. Just watch. Y'all love to talk about my sewing this, my tapings, that, but honey, have you tried a half wig? You tried one because do you see me right now and it only cost me what twenty dollars on amazon come on now sis <sighs> i'm not gonna keep telling y'all the proof is in the pudding this sensational half wig is hands down one of my favorites because it's just such va va voom glamorous hair if you have a special event to go to and you feel like wearing your natural hair out in that half up half down style are you kidding me glorious amazing fantastic unit especially for the price point i know sometimes the wigs on amazon can be a little bit higher but this unit is 19 or 20 dollars right now i'm looking at the screen i see it right now <laughs> and the natural color too it feels 
awesome. It's super soft and textured. And also you'll see here that I cut it too. So once it started getting a little bit too tangly to the point where I was tired of wearing it long and having to revive it, I just cut it. I cut it to this length right here, maybe like a 16 inch, and it looks beautiful in that length. Absolutely love it. IWD3 is a 10 out of 10 for me. For sure. They do have other numbers in this series as well, so I recommend you check those out too. This next wig, I feel like y'all slept on it a little bit. This is another wig from the Converti Cap series, Wavy Baby. These waves make me sick! <laughs> <laughs> They're so beautiful. And of course I had to get this this copper. This ginger copper color is fabulous. That's one thing about Outre, they really get the colors all the way right. Now of course it tangles very easily, especially because this is not like textured hair. It's more so like a, it reminds me of like a type 3A texture. It's a little bit silkier. And when you have longer silkier synthetic wigs, especially if they're clinging onto the fabrics of your clothing, you're going to get tangling at the nape. You're going to get tangling towards the ends. I always recommend my Simply Styling silicone spray because that just helps with the maintenance of your wigs. It definitely elongates the wear of your wigs. Now, of course, there are other factors that go into play when it comes to how long your wig will last. But Trust me, if you get this silicone spray, you're gonna notice the difference. A lot of y'all already bought it already since I've been talking about it for the past two and a half years. If you're new here, just add to the car, sis. I'm telling you, it makes a huge difference. Plus, it's a black-owned business, so I really, really like supporting my own. And knowing that it's a product that works for me, that I use on a regular basis, right here, this is it right here. Actually, I'm running out a little bit, but I have like five more bottles of these. <laughs> My people are simply styling, keep me stocked when it comes to this. So, very grateful for that. And lastly, we have one more Converti Cap wig by Outre. Little short cutie. I bought, bought this one back in 2020 as well. Sway Soiree. I feel like y'all slept on this one too. She's so stinking cute. Especially flipped over. Love her. I also appreciate her being a shorter synthetic wig because with the shorter ones, they last longer because they're not gripping on your clothes and things like that. So they can just be free. And of course, using your silicone spray, washing your wigs will help elongate wears. I really stand for this wig right here. I didn't wear it often enough. And that's the thing about me, someone who's been reviewing wigs for a long time, I have quite the collection, but I only have one head. So there are a lot of wigs that I just don't get to wear over and over again. I really only have room for my favorites. By the way, I am gonna be having a wig sale soon, so look out for that because I gotta get, some of these wigs gotta go. They gotta go. But yeah, Sway Soiree. $23 on Amazon right now. Check it out. Remember, everything is linked in my description box, so please check there. I organize everything very well, and if you have questions, you know, you can always drop a comment and let me know. So yes, y'all, these are all the wigs that I would bring into 2023. This is part one. I'm gonna bring y'all a part two, and if you're excited about that, make sure you let me know in the comments. I do read all my comments. Don't be shy. And some of y'all have been watching me for years and have never left a comment. What's up with that? Why are you not talking to me? <laughs> Come say hi to your girl. Make sure you subscribe if you're new here. Consider following me on Instagram, on TikTok. Actually, right now my TikTok account is banned. Ugh. I'm a little frustrated by that. Hopefully, by the time you see this in the future, it's unbanned and I have my account back because we have 27,000 followers over here there, y'all. And I was really building community. But you know, it's all right. We still have us over here on YouTube. We still have Instagram. We still have Amazon. So we're just going to cross our fingers, okay? But make sure you hit me up on other platforms. I'm pretty much on every social media platform. I have a space on every corner of social media at this point. Pinterest too. So let me know. Small Talk Saturday will be in the works. I will let you know when I drop that episode. It will be for this coming Saturday. What else do we have coming up? It's springtime. Spring is pretty much here so that's exciting if you have any travel plans coming up let me know i do have quite a few coming up i'll actually be back in jamaica in may I'm going to paris and amsterdam in june senegal in september we got a lot going on and i'm trying to incorporate more of my travels in vlog format for you all because i always say that and i never do it but this year i'm really trying to commit to it because it seems like when I do, you guys really enjoy that content. So thank you so much for joining me today for $20 Tuesday. Make sure you check out some of my latest videos over here. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.